This morning, members from local workers unions took to the free stamp. They are frustrated with the city of Cleveland after months and months of contract negotiations. Three News investigator Marissa Sines shows us why their frustration could soon become yours too. Your trash may not be picked up. Your streets may not be plowed. And repairs may stop coming to your water mains and more. It all boils down to a contract agreement that stands between the city of Cleveland and local union members. And the city is not looking to recognize what the essential workers did throughout COVID and certainly what other cities around the state of Ohio have recognized. The unions in the city and contract negotiations now for months. Leaders say the continued delay is due to wage proposals for workers. The wage package they're proposing is substandard. They're paid 10 to 15 percent less than their counterparts in most major cities in the state of Ohio. Frustration started in the early days of the pandemic. Our members were deemed essential and highly critical during that point. And a lot of our members contracted COVID and some of our members died from it. Union members claiming they never got hazard pay. Instead, the city wants to spend hundreds of thousands of dollars to a private law firm, to a private law firm for negotiations. Who are we? to basically combat our own workers. Negotiations will continue and include a fact finder who will serve as an impartial examiner to determine the facts of a case. But the union isn't hopeful of the outcome. Representatives of the city have already said to the union, even if the fact finder rules in our favor, that the city will not accept that. All this leading to a potential major labor dispute that would eventually trickle down to residents. Our members, they, they do waste collection, they do street repair, they do building and maintenance formants out at the airport. Our services are really important to the city of Cleveland residents. No strike or labor dispute is official just yet, and members stress this is not what they want. Our goal is that there will not be a strike. Our goal is that we can bring attention to this and that the mayor and the mayor's office recognize that we need to fix this problem. We reached out to the city for its side of negotiations, but as of now, Laura, we are still waiting for a response. Yeah, and we hope that they respond soon. Obviously, so. they're uh, very frustrated workers there. Yep, certainly so. All right, Marissa Signs, thank you. Sure.